Ko Ainor. One hundred and eight point ninety three karat cuts, India, circa seventeenth century, probably involved more shimming and torture than any other diamond. Name means mountain of light in Persians. Said to be unlucky if worn by a man, but in England it has been worn only by women. Queen Victoria, Queen Mary, and Queen Elizabeth II all long lived. Blue Fancy, 44.5 karat cuts, India, 17th century or before, owned mostly by king, bankers, and heiresses, said to be cursed. Great Mogul Two hundred and eighty carats cuts India circa one thousand six hundred the biggest diamond found in India recorded by G.B. Trevornier on India trip now lost perhaps became the core I know. Golden Jubilee Yellow Fancy 545.97 carats cuts South Africa 1990s The world's largest faceted diamonds Cut by Gabby Tolkowski in Antwerp and given to King Bumibol Abundet of Thailand for his Golden Jubilee in 1996, previously known as the Unknown Brown. Rest and green. Green fancy, 49.21 carats, pure cuts, possibly Brazil, 1720s. The largest green diamond known taken to Moscow after the Second World War. Now back in Dresden's Green Fall. Star of the South. One hundred and twenty-eight carat rose then brilliant Brazil eighteenth century, found by a slave who was given her freedom. 
owned by the Gag War of Baroda in a Cartier setting. By 2004, Cartier owns it again. Senchi. Fifty-five carats double rose cut worn in a turban by King Henry III of France after he went bald at 26. Lucky had been for King James I of England's jubilee in history. High body counts in the lower. Regent. Four hundred and ten carats rough, also known as the Pitt, after Thomas Pitt, president of Fort Madras. Pitt was accused of stealing the diamond from a poor Indian. Alexander Pope wrote a poem about it. Sold to France and stolen in 1792 with French crown jewels. Later discovered in a Paris garret. Once represented two thirds of the value of France crown jewels now in the lover. Mm -hmm. 